you're about to heat up. Who needs entrances anyway? Weighing in at 251 pounds, John. to get interesting. Oh, 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 yeah. And there's the bell. This match has started. This is a classic. Two guys battling it out one-on-one. -on -one. Remember, only the strong survive. Bringing it back between... Oh, lights out! Wow, he's still down after that. What's your analysis of Kalisto? Here's somebody who's willing to do just about anything to get to the top. I like it. That's the way it should be. Oh, you have to be on your toes when you're in the ring with Kalisto. Like most of his moves, the Salido del Sol could come out of nowhere. Callisto shows us some clever offense here. These competitors will always be looking to unleash their finishing maneuver, and when that happens, the complexion of the match can change in a heartbeat. You're right about that. The entire match can end in a heartbeat if somebody hits their big move. Back to the Salida del Sol. I'd say part of the reason why it's so effective is because it's so dizzy. Police those opponents barely know where they are. And before you know it, boom, they're hit with a Salida del Sol. Yeah, and I can hardly pronounce it. But you know, in addition to being dizzy, it has to do a number on the back of your head and your neck. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. I'm not sure I can watch this. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Kalisto. Back between the ropes. Man, Kalisto, what offense. Just look at this. You can see the results from that move. You know, Cole, I'd love to sit here and describe Kalisto's amazing offense, but I don't think my words could do them justice. They really have to be seen to be believed. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Keep the action inside the ring. That's where you're going to win this thing. A terrific reversal by Kalisto. I've been in there with Cena when he's like this. I became a former WWE champion because of it. When John Cena gets like this, he can bust through cinder block walls and not slow down a step. I have a strong feeling these guys will throw caution to the wind and just go full steam ahead. I hope you're right. That's exactly what I want to see. I don't think there's an area on that back that's not suffering right now. Yeah, when he wakes up in the morning, the only thing on his body that's not going to hurt is his pajamas. Like you, King, I have to remind myself to call the action when Kalisto's in the ring rather than sit back and watch and complete all. You do that a lot, and it's so easy to get caught up in his offense. It's seriously unlike anything we've ever seen before. John Cena with the offense. It is so hard to stop that kind of strength. Whoa, what the? Look at this from Kalisto. Kalisto can create his own momentum so easily that he can amaze an opponent or audience. And again, he gets 
struck with that object. Well, I don't know if you would categorize this as innovative offense, but it sure gets the job done. Just look at what's going on here. It is human destruction. Oh, looking to make a statement here. If a superstar wants to lock up with John Cena, they're going to have to be ready for the STF. We all know about Cena's high power. Wow, what a move from Kalisto. That's how you make this crowd stand on its feet. Boy, he just got laid out. He set it up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, she blows the RKO. Who do you think you are, Captain Ahab? What a finishing maneuver. This could be it. It's got to be it. Kalisto is scaling the ropes a second time. Absorbing a little bit of punishment here. Nothing to be overly... Watch out! An attack. You must be able to expand your chest in order to breathe. I bet he feels like he's inside an anaconda. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. And he dodges that one. Not today. Too fast. Thinking to avoid that. He's setting it up. Look at those eyes. We're looking at complete domination here. John Cena has proved to be on a roll right now. Boy, there's no way he's going to be able to stand after that. Direct hit. I don't know if you can get back on your feet after that. Getting tagged like that might be enough to keep an opponent down for good. the ribs and the lower back that just takes all of the power out of you i have a feeling we're going to see several more demonstrations like that before the night's over hang on oh that's it that's got to be it kalisto now that's a finishing move people wow now that's what you call a finisher this might be it hot damn it's exciting Another electric crowd on hand here for SmackDown, as has been the norm over the years. There's no recovering from that. Kalisto's plan has got him on a roll here tonight. Whoa, what the? Look at this from Kalisto. Kalisto can create his own momentum so easily that he can amaze an opponent or audience. So much for a safe work environment. Much more, and WWE might get slapped with a lawsuit. to say the entire WWE locker room has just been put on notice. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. Oh, nice counter. Oh, out of nowhere. Oh, gosh. Hey, what do you want for him? He can do it here. I think he's got him. Two. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. Oh, look at Cena go. Not today. Too fast. Cena's got him. Keep your eye on Cena. Looking for all the glory here. And the shoulder's up in time. Well, as long as it's up before that three count, that's all that matters. Wow, what a display of heart and determination. DDT, that could be it. He's got to be history. 
Is he still even conscious? Oh, man. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. When this guy's on, look out. What a move! What a smart move! Quick thinking to avoid that. From what we've seen and heard tonight, there must be serious injuries. No kidding, this is going to need some serious medical attention. Here we go. John Cena setting it up. He simply refuses to stay down. Man, oh man, did he take a wild swing with that one. Good right. That was wild indeed. Good thing we're over here. Wow. He's still down after that. He's showing no signs of letting up. Oh, and did you hear the impact? Oh, look out. All right, now that's what I'm talking about. This just became my kind of fight. I like it when things get down and dirty in there. He takes to the air. Wow. Can he score the pin? And he escapes with a kick out. After the amount of punishment he suffered, it's simply amazing that he's still in this one. Well, that missed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. This match has taken so much out of this guy. He's not going to give up. But man, this has been physical. Not this. He's looking at it. That's how you move up the ladder here in WWE. It hurts just watching it again. Ouch. He thinks he has it. One, two. Watch it. Oh, nice assist from the kendo stick. Oh, there's a lot to hit there. Now the question going for the cover. One, two. And it's up. He got the shoulder off just when you thought it was over. Wow. Well, well, well. That's the first time tonight we've seen that move. I wouldn't mind seeing it a little more often. As we've seen so far in this match, anything goes here in this no disqualification atmosphere. Yeah, and at this point, I'm surprised these competitors are still in this thing, considering the punishment they've taken so far. Can he score the pin? Two. And he escapes with a kick out. You can't teach heart. Believe me when I tell you this guy is filled with it. Look at him unloading with the dance press. Oh, wow. Hey, the shoulders are dead. What's he doing? Stop the count, ref. One. Two. Three. Ladies and gentlemen, that was simply a case of one guy determined to prove his dominance over another. Yeah, you can bet they're going to be talking about this match for quite some time.